Hello, it's day eight, and I hope and pray that all of you have had a wonderful week fasting. I know some of you are maybe just starting with us this week, but today I want to talk to you about something that's really kind of a struggle for me and has been in years past. Every single year, there, there's, there are specific things that I fast for, and uh, one of the things that is really tough, not just for me, but for everybody, is controlling your tongue and controlling what comes out of your mouth. I, I you're like me. Every time you go to the doctor and have since you were little, every time you go to the doctor, they do something that really grosses me out and I hate it. Just even think about it, it makes me want to gag almost. They take this stick and they ask you to stick out your tongue and they do this gag reflex. But a lot of times they can tell just by looking at your tongue whether you're sick or not or what's going on. And you know what? I think sometimes in our life that it's almost like that with God. We come to God with our prayers and and basically what he's wanting to say to us, you know what, just stick out your tongue. And almost instantly, God can tell the condition of our heart and our body and our mind just by looking at our tongue. And scripture puts it this way in Proverbs chapter 12, verse 18. It says, the words of, a recl the, words of the reckless pierce like swords, but the tongue of the wise brings healing. Proverbs 18, 21 says this, the tongue has the power of both life and death and those who love it will eat its fruit. We've got to be careful that when the words that we speak and the things that we say, we got to remember that when we do that, it produces fruit. And it doesn't just hurt the person if you're being negative and critical or judgmental towards someone. It doesn't just hurt that person. It doesn't just speak death to them. But it also produces that fruit of death that we eat of. And because of that, we become, uh, we become negative and we become judgmental because of our words. We need to remember to speak life. And one of my prayers for me is during this fast, that during this fasting, that God will help me to control my tongue. And that God will help me realize that the things that come out of my mouth and the things that I say, both good and bad, doesn't just affect the people I'm saying them to or saying them about, but it affects me as well. And so I hope this helps you today. Remember that the words that you speak, it has both life and death. Pray and seek God over the next few days and next few weeks during this fasting time and really ask God to help you to control your tongue and to truly realize the power of the spoken word. God bless you and I'll see you tomorrow.